Okay, hello everybody. Uh, this week I am in, or we are in Sorong in West Papua, and I'm with uh, Daniel um, Bakasa, who is the head of sustainability for the marketing side or the, the supply chain. The supply chain. Supply chain. Head of Supply Chain Sustainability for Golden Agri Resources in Singapore um, and we've been doing a trip to one of our potential plantations in, uh, in South Sorong and interviewing the local people to see how they feel about the plantation. So I just ask a few questions, right? And what about, we, we both work in the palm oil industry, what, what do you see and how do you see the palm oil uh, market? Let's say in supply and demand. I think there definitely should be a, a slowing of growth in terms of supply. Right. We see that effect probably gonna be kick in uh, in, in three or four years time. But I think the, the planting uh, seem to have been slowing down. And then in sustainability, what, what do you see the main theme this year in sustainability? Sustainability, I think there's, there's a lot of uh, work on supply chains. Uh, uh, I think the, there's also more, a lot of more focus on, on social issues. You know? uh, I think uh, the, there's a shift from uh, environmental uh, to social, uh, especially. Labor practices within the plantation, uh, also how the plantations affect the surrounding communities. Uh, Better conditions. Yeah, to improve practices, improve processes on how they engage their workers and engage uh, the communities living around their operation. Maintain the. Uh, uh, Which is what we were doing on this trip. Uh, this trip was quite an eye opener. Uh, uh, Sorong, first of all, very impressed on what's going on in the. This is the first time I visited Papua. Uh -huh. Papua we visited the village. Uh, they were very um, uh, hoping for uh, progress. Yeah. Yes. I think sometimes they looking for a better life. Looking for a better life. They're looking for development, and I think they see. A potential palm oil expansion as, as a way to in, in, uh, improve livelihoods. I mean, they, they, I think one lady we talked to uh, said that uh, there's 85 percent of unemployment in the, in the village. Yes. Fifteen percent have to make the money, uh, the money to support everybody else. And, I mean, they see palm oil as uh, a way to get jobs for, yes. for, for these people. 